December 1st, so welcome to Vlogmas! Um, I'm really excited about doing Vlogmas this year, but I have school the first two weeks of December, so I'm going to be kind of busy, so I have decided to do like week one of Vlogmas and then week two of Vlogmas as one video, so I'll just vlog every single day and then post it either on Saturday or Sunday, and then after that we'll try and do like either daily or every other day with the vlogmas videos so i hope you guys are excited like i said today is december 1st so let's just get started so we are actually going to the Steeler game today me nico and my dad and then his friends that he always goes with so i have to hurry up and leave he's getting a little bit mad that i am a little bit late getting ready so hopefully this will be a good game and it'll be exciting i don't know how much i'm gonna vlog there because it is supposed to be raining so I don't know if I want to like pull my camera out and st or my phone out since it is raining so we'll see but I am excited. since we last chatted we obviously left the sealer game we won so that was really fun and we just went back to my house afterwards to have some dinner we had soup and then i packed all my stuff to get ready to come back to school which is where i am now it's about 9 30 ish so i just drove back to school and i'm gonna head inside and unpack all my stuff and then I have a homework assignment that I need to do that is due tomorrow, so hopefully that won't take me too long and then I can kind of unwind and go to bed because I am super tired. So if I don't talk to you guys um, before I go to sleep, I will see you guys tomorrow for day two of Vlogmas. Hi guys, good morning. Welcome to Vlogmas day two. It is December 2nd, obviously. It's about 8.30 right now. I woke up a little bit later than I wanted to, but I was also up. A little bit later than I wanted to be so I'm gonna head to the gym right now I have a long walk ahead of me to the gym um, but yeah I'll talk to you guys after I get back today is going to be my like arm upper body day so we'll see how it goes I just got back from the gym, made myself a little protein shake. I filmed a clip of it, but it wasn't too good, so I don't know if you'll see it, but I'm about to get a shower and then do some work. Lots of work to do. <laughs> okay, so I'm all ready for the day. It is about one o'clock right now. I have to leave for class around three. I have an interview with my ASL professor as part of like my final. It's only five minutes though, so it's not too bad. I just have to review some signs right now so that I can understand her and respond correctly to get a good grade. Um, but I'll show you my outfit before I leave with my shoes and everything. And yeah, I'm just going to study for the next like two-ish hours and then go to class till 7.15 and then come back, make dinner, and probably watch some of the football games since I have people in my fantasy football league playing and study more because I have three more finals this week so yay about three o'clock so I have to get going for class but I just wanted to show you my outfit real quick first it's nothing really special but um I'm just wearing this gray pullover from Adidas it's Adidas and raining champs I think I got this at the outlets for a pretty good deal like last year maybe and then I have on these Adidas leggings as well and then I have on these cute little Adidas sneakers. These are the Arkin style, and I absolutely love them. They are so cute and comfortable. And then I also have on this hat, but I'm going to have to take it off whenever I go see my ASL professor because I'm not allowed to wear hats because it kind of hides our facial expressions. So, yeah, that is what I have on on this Monday morning. Well, afternoon now. It's not morning. So it is kind of raining right now, but I'm on my way to class. Um, I have to hurry up. 
I've left a little later than I wanted to. I think I left off showing you my chicken. I don't know if I'll put that in. Um, I have frozen chicken, so I was getting out to thaw for dinner tonight, but the bag was kind of um, like broken. I mean, the seal like wasn't where it was supposed to be, so it's kind of hard to open. I had to cut it and everything, so that took a little longer than I would have liked. And I was normally I let my chicken like sit out on the counter on a plate covered to thaw, but I'm gonna be gone for like five ish hours, so I didn't want to leave it out, so I just put it in the fridge and we'll let it thaw afterwards when I get home later. Um, it's gonna be a late dinner though, so I'm planning on making asparagus and um, potatoes and baking the chicken and stuff, so we'll see. So I just finished my ASL expressive final, so my professor and I chatted for a few minutes. It went pretty well, I think. Um, so now I'm on my way down. I wanted to go get coffee, but I don't think I have time now, so that's a bummer. But also, it's so pretty when the red's decorated for Christmas here in the cathedral. just uploaded it like at the beginning of my stats class and I wanted to watch it so badly because it's exciting she's having another baby. Hi guys, um, so it is almost nine in the morning. I kind of stopped vlogging last night because, well, I fell asleep and then I was doing some homework so nothing really exciting. But right now I'm on my way to volunteer. Um, just leaving my parking lot and I'll be there till noon and then afterwards I'll make some lunch and do some more schoolwork. So I'll talk to you guys in a little bit. Hi guys, so it is about 12.30. I am just about to leave the hospital where I volunteer at. Today was my last day and it was so sad, but it was so, it was like the best day ever there. I got to stay with a little 10 month old baby for the whole time I was there. So it was so cute. Um, I just got to play with him and just chill out and cuddle him and it was absolutely adorable. I loved it so much. So yeah, it was a good last day, but also a little bit sad. Um, so yeah, I'm headed home now to my apartment to make some lunch and then do some studying and then go to class. My first class today is until four. It's usually at three o'clock, but that class is canceled because I had my um, like expressive part of my final yesterday and then people are doing theirs today. It's for my sign language class. So yeah, our class is canceled today, which is nice. So I don't have to leave for class until like 3.30, which will be super nice and give me some extra time to get stuff done. So I'll talk to you guys whenever I get home. But I just wanted to show you what I was wearing real quick. I just have on this yellow sweater from TJ Maxx, I believe. My Tom Girl jeans from American Eagle and my Docs. And this nice brown lipstick from Tarte. I really like it. Kind of annoyed by this turtleneck and how high it is, but it's also keeping me very warm in this freezing cold Pittsburgh weather. It's not even that cold out, but I think because it was, it got cold out so abruptly, it feels like freezing out right now. And I don't like it, but I do love winter fashion, so that kind of helps a little bit. Also, I'm wearing this coat from American Eagle that is my absolute favorite. So, 
school. I'm on my way back from class. My class got out a little bit early, which was nice. So it'll give me some more time to do some work. But in reality, more time to watch some Vlogmas videos. Okay, hi guys. Um, so it is about 5.15. I just got back from class. Um, it is kind of like dinner time, but I'm not that hungry. I had a little bit of a later lunch, probably around like 1 o'clock. So I'm going to wait a little bit to heat up some food. I'm just going to have what I made yesterday for dinner. Since I made extra, I made like a sheet pan chicken with um, asparagus and like little red potatoes. So I'm just going to have that for dinner again, but probably not until like 7-ish maybe. But I did want to have some coffee today because I didn't have my coffee yet today and I've just been really wanting coffee all day long and I shouldn't have time to get it before class. So I actually made some cold brew coffee um, Sunday night um, and it's been in my fridge since then. So I'm going to have some of that and I'm going to show you what I do to make it. Okay, so I have all of my stuff here. I'm just going to use this reusable Starbucks cup for cold beverages. I think this is like four dollars at Starbucks it's like the most basic one and definitely a great purchase I try to remember to take it to Starbucks when I can but it's still great for like at home stuff too and I like a lot of ice in my iced coffee so I'm probably honestly gonna put most of this ice cube tray into my cup probably not all of it because that's a little excessive um, but then I'm gonna use this creamer this is just the coffee mate vanilla um, it's pretty good um, you know it's just basic vanilla I like it um, and then this is actually what I use to make my cold brew. Um, this is from the brand, oh, sorry, and that just fell, great. Um, this is the brand that it is from, um, I know, like, Bodum, I think that's the other brand that sells a lot of these, like, cold brew coffee makers and French press, um, but honestly, you can find them anywhere, like, if you just look on Amazon for one with good ratings, I can link some down below, too, but I love this thing. I have actually a different one at my house that I think is from bottom and basically with that one you just put the grounds and the water together into this pitcher and then once you let it sit overnight and then once you go to get it in the morning it has like a little french press thing that you just press all the grounds down to the bottom and then you're just left with your coffee this one is a little bit different because you put the um grounds into this like strainer thing in the center and then you just let it sit for like 24 hours and then you have your coffee. So that is what I use to make my cold brew coffee. I do like the other one that I have at my house um, more than this one. I mean, this one still tastes okay, but I just think that the other one tastes better. I don't know why. It's not really that much of a difference. But yeah, it's pretty easy and simple to make. The only, I don't know, downside of this is kind of cleaning it out because this one kind of gets a little icky on the inside where the grounds are because it's kind of hard to clean, especially since it's mesh, you can't like fill it up with water and like rinse it out. So you kind of have to like reach in and, you know, scrub it out. But the other one is pretty easy because all of the stuff is just at the bottom of the pitcher and then you can just rinse it out and wash it as normal. So yeah, that's how I'm going to make my iced coffee. final product of my coffee obviously it has been drank a little bit because I taste tested it but it's pretty good it's not like the best coffee ever but it gets the job done you know um so I enjoy it plus it's easy to make and I really love cold coffee so I find that this is kind of the best way to make it at home because I don't like making hot coffee and then letting it sit out or put it in the fridge or something to get cold so I really like this method and you know if you guys have any recommendations on cold coffee making at home definitely let me know but um hopefully this will be helpful to some of you that may enjoy cold coffee like I do oh, I can't get over my hair right now um but I'm just gonna drink this and probably watch some other people's vlogmas videos um that they posted today and then um, I'm gonna do a lot of work. Hopefully this caffeine will help me stay awake because I have a lot of schoolwork to get done later tonight. I have three final exams tomorrow, so everyone pray for me. Um, hopefully they go well, but yeah, I'm just gonna have this, do some work, 
have some dinner and probably just chill out here all night doing homework and preparing for these exams tomorrow. So I'll talk to you guys whenever I do something interesting. Hi guys, good morning and welcome to day four of Vlogmas. Um, I'm currently masking because I'm gonna let this dry and then take a shower. Um, it's currently a little after nine in the morning. It is a lot later than I wanted it to be though. Um, I was up until like 3 a.m. doing schoolwork and studying. So it was a very late night. Ideally, I wanted to get up at like 7.30 and go to the gym to do like leg day and stuff. But that's not going to happen today because my walk to the gym is like 15 minutes. So that's like 30 minutes already back and forth plus the time that I would spend there. So it's just way too late to do that. Even though I would really like to go to the gym, it's probably not going to happen today. So I'm just going to do some like squats and abs and stuff here um, to get at least something in. And then shower, get ready for the day and study for my three exams day. I still have a fair amount of stuff to do, so hopefully I can get it all done before three o'clock, which is when my first exam is, and then I have two others, like, back-to-back -back right after that, so it's gonna be a long day, but it's gonna be great once it's over, so I'll talk to you guys once I get ready. Okay, so I just finished up getting ready, um, and I made myself a little breakfast day. I mean, it's kind of late for breakfast, so maybe a snack. I just um, put some vanilla Greek yogurt in this bowl and then added some blackberries and strawberries, and then I sprinkled some dry oats in there with a little bit of cinnamon, too. I know it seems like a lot of strawberries, but I'm trying to use them up before I go home this weekend because I don't want them to go bad. So, yeah, that is my breakfast slash afternoon snack. Okay, so just a quick little update. So it is about like 1.15. I have to leave for class around 2.30ish. Um, so I still have like about an hour. I studied for my stats final and my medical anthropology final, but I still have to study for my ASL final, which I have today and tomorrow. So I have to get on that. It's not too hard though, so I'm kind of like, I don't want to do it. But I was just watching um, Jessica and Tyler Braun's vlogmas videos if you have never seen their channel i would highly suggest it they're just like the cutest couple ever and the most real people and it. it's just like so enjoyable to watch especially their vlogmas videos i love watching them every year but i really want to try later after my finals are all done and i have to meet with a group for a project later but after that i really want to try to make an intro for one my youtube channel in general but also for my vlogmas videos so if I did get that done, you guys will have already seen it in this video. Just a quick little outfit of the day before I leave for class. I just have on this um, Adidas hoodie. It's like a tannish color. It's neutral and I love it. And then I have on these airy leggings, my Arkans again, and then this coat from Eddie Bauer and obviously my Adidas hat. I will probably throw on a scarf too, even though it doesn't match, just because it is a little chilly out and it's snowing, I think, so I want to be very warm. This is my favorite hidden stairwell in the cathedral. Hi guys, it is about 7.30. I just got back from my full day of exams. I just had my stats final, which went pretty well, I think, and the other two went pretty well as well. Um, I still have a presentation tomorrow and a final exam tomorrow and then one next week still. So we're kind of in the clear. Today was my busiest day, so I'm happy that it's over. Um, I'm gonna, just going to have some dinner and chill out for a little bit. And then at 8.30 I have to go practice my presentation with my group that I'm doing it with tomorrow. And that's going to happen at like 8.30, so I'll probably leave around 8.10ish to drive there because it might take a little bit. Um of time to find parking since you know I'm obviously in the city so it's kind of hard to find street parking but yeah that is what's on tonight's agenda and I think I mentioned it earlier but I think afterwards tonight I'm gonna forego studying for my exam tomorrow just because I already studied for it today and it's kind of like the same thing so I'll just look it over um, tomorrow a little bit before I go take it but I'm planning on trying to make an intro for my vlogmas videos and 
my channel in general. So I'll let you guys know how that goes and I'm gonna go have some dinner because I am starving. Hi guys, sorry it's kinda dark. I just got back from practicing my presentation with my group. It's about 9.30 now. And yeah, I'm gonna go inside and chill for a little, not have to worry about homework or anything because school is basically over for me now, except for the two exams I still have. But it's not that big of a deal. Um, they're pretty easy. So yeah, I'm gonna go in and chill, put my PJs on, maybe do a face mask, and try to make these YouTube intros. So wish me luck. Okay, so I just got into my PJs. And I think I'm gonna do uh, some sort of mask tonight. Um, so this morning I did the pore purifying mask from Bio Race. Um, I think I got this in Ipsy. I've never heard of this brand before, but I like the mask. And then last night I actually used this men's face mask. I got one for Nico a few years, well, I think like last year maybe. No, nope. I don't remember. But I actually got one of these for Nico and I got one for myself too. It's a pore cleansing, um, like peel off clay mask and it has volcanic ash in it. Um, I know it's men's, but I don't really think it, it just like smells like men's stuff. Um, so that's really the only difference that I think it makes between men's and women's. So yeah, I really like this mask. I think it's, you can get it at like Walmart, Target, Amazon probably, um, but I did that one last night, and I think tonight I am going to do the one of these Wander Beauty um, baggage claim gold eye masks. So these are just for like under your eyes, and I didn't get much sleep last night, so I think this would be a good rejuvenator. Hi guys, it is like 7.50, and I'm on my way to my 8 a.m. class. I have a presentation in this class. Um, I think we're just listening to other presentations today. And then, I don't know if we're learning anything else. I think we finished all the material, so hopefully I'll get out early because I am planning on putting some eye makeup on whenever I get back. I just didn't have time to this morning, plus my eyes are kind of tired, so I didn't want to bother them with mascara. And then I'm planning on filming a gift guide video, which should probably be up already by the time you're seeing this, so I will link it up above, and what else? And then I have to study for my other final exam today, and then I think I might go home later or go see me go, but we will see if I go home tonight or tomorrow. Okay guys, I started to untie my boots, but then I realized I didn't show you an outfit of the day yet because I was a little bit rushed this morning. So I just have on this sweater. This I got at Marshalls, but it's from the Olive and Oak brand, and it's so comfy. This was actually in my um, fall clothing haul. That was, I think I did in the beginning of November maybe, or the end of October. Um, and then I have on these jeans from Francesca's. These are the Harper Heritage brand and I just cuffed them. And then I have on my docks. So this is my outfit for Thursday. Okay, so it is almost 11 o'clock. I'm gonna go ahead and do some eye makeup real quick and then do something with my hair because it is, I'm having a bad hair day. And then I'm going to film my um, gift guide for girls. So that should probably be up, like I said, before this video so I will link it up there but hopefully I can get all of that done and study for my ASL final two before I have class at three o'clock so we'll see okay so I just got done filming my gift guide of poor girls wow that took a long time so it is about 1 15 now um and I'm gonna make some eggs and also study a little bit for my ASL final that I have coming up in a few hours, like an hour and a half. Um, so yeah, that is what is on the agenda for the rest of the afternoon. I had a huge crisis while I was filming that video though. So I typed up um, like all of the items that I wanted to mention in my notes app on my phone. And since it's shared on iCloud, I also was typing them up um, on my laptop as well and I had my laptop up with the notes open while I was filming the video to use as a reference 
and when I was in the middle of it, the note just randomly disappeared. I have no idea what happened. My first thought was that, like, oh, my sister probably just, like, deleted it accidentally while um, she was on her phone or something, but I texted her and my mom and my dad, who were also on the iCloud, and they were like, no, we didn't touch anything. So I don't know how this note just randomly disappeared right in front of my eyes. And the weird thing was it went into my recently deleted folder for like a hot second and then it just disappeared from there. Like someone just wanted to screw my video over and say, you shouldn't have filmed this. Um, but I finished it anyways. I tried to remember most of the list. So if it's a little short of 100, that is why. But yeah, it was a crazy experience. Wow, it is freezing outside. Um, so it is about 6.30. I think when we last chatted, I was either on my way to class or just before I left my apartment for class. Um, but I changed my clothes, obviously. I changed into something a little bit comfier. Um, I am just gonna go hang out at Nico's house for a little bit now and then see what the night brings. We'll probably just watch Shameless or something like that. Um, but yeah, so this weekend is my sister's birthday. So I'll be home for that and that'll be fun. I only have one final next week and then a paper due, but that I can turn in online. So I don't know if I'll be back to my apartment or not next week. I definitely I definitely have to run in to pick up my books that I have to return to Amazon because I didn't feel like doing that right now and bringing them with me because I packed up all my other stuff that I knew was going to be staying at home with me over break. So I don't have to worry about that next week because I kind of have like a busy-ish week next week despite the fact that I only have one final. Um, but that is for a whole new week of Vlogmas, um, so you'll hear about all of that next week. But yeah, so I am going to go drive my car right now, hopefully have some food in his house because I am starving, and I will talk to you guys either later tonight or tomorrow morning. Hello guys! Sorry, my mirror is in the way. Um, welcome to Vlogmas Day 6. It is a little bit late. Um, it is currently like 12.30, almost 1. I just got ready. I was editing a video this morning and it took freaking forever. Um, it was my, uh, gift guide video and that one is, it was so long and I apologize for it being so long. I just can't shut up. But today, um, I don't know what we're doing yet. Um, so it's gonna be a little bit of a surprise for me and you both, but I am currently at home. I just got ready and did my makeup. My room is an absolute disaster. I hate my bedroom at home so much. I've been wanting to redo it for a long, long time. And there was a hot second there in the summer where I picked out a color somewhat and was like, yeah, we're going to do this. And then I realized how much work it would be to redo my room because I have to push all my furniture to the center to paint it. And I just have so much junk and stuff laying around here. It is absolutely disgusting and I need to go through all my clothes so that all the stuff that is like laying on my bed and throughout my room has somewhere to go while I paint my room and it's it's just a big fiasco. So I want to try to get that done though over break so stay tuned for that. I can't believe I'm actually like showing my room on camera. I hate this wall color. It is way too bright for me. I picked it out when I was like in fifth or sixth grade. So, yes, a room makeover has been long overdue, um, but yeah, I'm here nonetheless, so let's just get started with our day. Okay, so I am just about to leave. Nico and I are going to go somewhere. I don't know where yet, but just to get out of the house and do something fun, but I got some packages in the mail um, this week, which was really exciting. So I'm just going to show you. They're actually Christmas gifts and a birthday gift for my sister's birthday, which is tomorrow. I'm not going to show you exactly what I got because I'm afraid that um, the people that I got these gifts for, aka Nico and my sister, um, might accidentally or purposely watch this part of the video before I give them their gifts and I want them to be surprised when I really get them. So you'll just have to stay tuned for... A later video of what I got them if you wanted to see that I guess. I'm debating if I should get Starbucks or not in here. Should I? And I see. Oh god. I look so gross already. Don't you? 
Is it gross? No. I just drank a raw egg too. So did Nico. It's kind of gross, but I don't know. It didn't really taste like anything. I don't think I could drink one every day though. Currently at Nico's house, he's playing video games. I think Minecraft. Um, and I am editing a video. Um, I edited all the sporting and did like I don't know why my nose is so stuffy. Um, but I did like all the cuts and everything. But now I'm just adding pictures and numbers. So it's taking a long time, but I'm gonna be excited once it is over and we are ordering pizza for dinner. So I'm pretty excited about that because I love pizza. So yeah, it's a fun night. About 30 years ago, when, as you may have guessed, that's where our story begins. Hi guys, what's up? And welcome to Vlogmas Day 7. It is about like noon right now getting ready for the day had a little bit of a late start um but it's okay it's the weekend so today is obviously saturday today's also my sister's birthday which is really fun we're having our family over and just having like a big party well not like a huge party but you know just like a family party so that'll be fun and i'll vlog a little bit there but now i have to get ready and then nico and i have to go pick up my sister from her dance class at two which will be cute because I'll get to go in and I haven't been there in a while but I used to dance at this dance studio and I'll get to see my old dance teacher which will be exciting just for like a few minutes and I also have to go to a store that sells scrubs to see if they have any scrubs because they start my new job next week so hopefully I only have one pair right now but I need a second one because I can't obviously wear the same pair of scrubs every single day and yeah so we have a fun day I'm not wearing this today but I just wanted to show you this sweater, don't mind my horribly messy room. In the background, I'm really in the mood to like, just clean it and overhaul everything and go through my clothes and donate stuff and paint my room and all of that. But I wanted to show you this sweater that I ordered. I think I showed you like, it, but not on yesterday. Um, so yeah, this is what it looks like on. It's really cute. It has these cute um, balloon sleeves. It's from American Eagle, if I didn't say that before. And it's really, really cute. I'm not wearing it today because I want to wear it with, like, blue jeans, but I also want to save it for, like, a little bit closer to Christmas. My mom just got home with a bunch of groceries, so, well, I also got ready. I should probably say that first, but we're helping her unload the groceries real quick, and then we're going to be on our way. I thought I wanted to wear red lipstick, but now I'm not too sure about it, so I'll probably leave it on and then see how I feel about it and maybe change to a nude for later because I kind of feel like a little much with all of this on especially to just run errands and pick my sister up and I don't know it might be more festive for the party but we'll see also sorry I'm not in front of a mirror but I just have on this sweater from Marshalls and then these black jeans and shoes. so the plan was to go get scrubs and maybe Starbucks before getting Gia but we've been on this street for how long like 20 minutes maybe so, hopefully we get out of here fast so we don't, so we're not late for her. So we just got home from getting Gia. I didn't get to go to the waterfront and get scrubs because there was a lot of traffic. Um, so now we're just gonna get ready for tonight, set up stuff in the house, probably help my mom like cook stuff and all that sort of fun stuff. Plus I want to get started on my room too and like cleaning stuff out, so. Hopefully it'll be a few productive hours. Boublé. Having a buble. No, this drink is okay. I don't know. I think I put a little too much on my gyro. I'm not gonna be able to close it. We just had dinner. So I'm so stuffed. Gia is getting ready to open her gift, so it's gonna be super cute. I'm excited to see Gee, what do you her think reaction that brown one is? Um, to what I got her and yeah, what, do you think what everyone brown else got her. Is? Oh gosh, his eyes look crazy. Um, everyone just left my house, my aunt and my cousins and my uncle, 
who were the last ones to leave just left and I just changed my clothes into some joggers and a sweatshirt and that officially concludes this first week of vlogmas. I had so much fun filming for you guys so I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I would definitely continue vlogging every single day for next week's vlogmas and um, that video will be up next weekend probably like Sunday so be on the lookout for that but thank you guys so much for watching and happy holidays. Thank you.